going guys it's chucky from mad bar reptiles today we're gonna talk about my cuban nano enclosure the six foot tall enclosure and let's go inside So I just found Delta down here. As you guys saw, he ate a worm from my hand, but he was actually trying to bite me. He has become a little bit of a meanie. As you guys can see, he's opening his mouth. He would run to my hand and just bite it. Um, I don't know why he became this mean, but I have no problem with him as long as he is uh, healthy and he's eating and he is happy here. I have no problem with not handling him. He's an amazing animal and he is a wild cat. So whoa, whoa, whoa. So of course, I'm okay with him being wild. That's what I wanted for him. I wanted him to feel at home. And I guess he's feeling at home. He's defending his territory because I'm messing with him. And this is just his enclosure. There's plants, there's things for him to climb on. He's always up here. He's feeding great on fruits and insects. Don't mind the noise in the background. It's become pretty evil and I'm okay with it. Look how beautiful that green is. So this is an update on the enclosure, not the animal itself. I'll do an update on everything he's doing, like feeding and all that later on. I just wanted you guys to see how the plants are growing in here. It's looking amazing. Uh, it's not fully grown. I want all the dirt to be covered with plants. It would happen soon. The plants are growing by themselves, as you guys can see over there. And it's just gonna be all green. And over here is just gonna be that. And I want it to be bioactive in a way. So, Things are gonna get better and better for this enclosure and you guys are gonna get to see it all. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, by the way. Y'all need to subscribe.